Beautiful, isn't it? That's the Wisconsin Intergenerational Orchestra. You can hear them perform live in person at their spring concert coming up May 10th. Joining us live in studio now to talk about this, Anne Marie Peterson and our very own Brendan Johnson. He is a member of the orchestra. Yes. Yeah. And uh, rumor has it your trumpet yes. is somewhere in the building. Not sure if we'll get a no, preview no, right I, now. I, I didn't want to bring out the trumpet just uh, quite yet, but this has been my practice area, as a matter of fact, the oh. studio and some of our other adjoining studios. Because you're a recent member of the orchestra. Anne yeah. Marie, yes. you helped recruit Brendan. You and I first met about yes. two years ago previewing um, the winter show. And here we are about to talk about another spring show. Tell our viewers a little bit about the orchestra because it's such a unique concept. It is, the, the orchestra is made of the most wonderful people on the planet that come together every week to form a community. It's more than an orchestra. It's, it's really a caring and uh, inclusive group of people that happen to be musicians. Some are very, very fine musicians, some not, but the ones that aren't, they bring something else to the mix. And yeah, we spotted Brendan as he was preparing to uh, play outside the public market yes. to uh, <laughs> raise funds for a charity. Yeah. And he was so joyful and we didn't even have a trumpet spot open, but I knew he belonged in <laughs> intergenerational orchestra. So I, I was never a band kid, but I get the sense. Well, I know what I know about band kids is you stick together and your friendships yeah. are lifelong from mm -hmm. that. This seems to me like just an offshoot mm -hmm. of being a band kid and knowing that you love this group of people around. It's been really great to get back into it because, yeah, to your point, last time I was playing a trumpet was high school, 10 years ago. Yeah. It's been a while, uh, but there are still so many friends that I keep in touch with from mm -hmm. band all the way back then. So I was kind of looking for a chance to get back into it. I'd always been putting it off. And I did that little piece with our Sydney Orr for right. Salvation Army mm -hmm. outside the public market. Mm -hmm. And the next morning I had an email from Anne Marie and I'm just like, you know, this is a sign. I really yeah. should do it. And this is, if I'm gonna do it, this is it. And it's been great. She knows talent when she can exactly. it. I mean, I spotted you. <laughs> so all ages, all abilities. Yes. What can people expect at this spring show? I know there's oh. a special piece that's gonna be featured. It's an incredible concert from late Renaissance music featuring our wonderful winds to uh, huge pieces like the Brahms Hungarian dances and the centerpieces probably Rhapsody in Blue uh, with our guest conductor Sal Tarazi and a wonderful young pianist. Uh, Masha Malenkine. And we have the Amazing Grace Chorus coming to sing with us. They will have the whole audience singing uh, together. It, the Amazing Grace uh, Chorus is uh, basically Alzheimer's uh, patients and their caregivers and oh. they have a wonderful, wonderful uh, group of musicians that leads them. And I will say it was awesome rehearsing with them. They're a great group. Rhapsody in Blue, I grew up listening to. Mm -hmm. It's kind of really cool, full circle to be able to actually perform it. Uh, it's the 100th anniversary yes. of oh, the wow. piece. Mm -hmm. So it's a really cool, you know, watershed. Yeah, moment. orchestras all over the world are playing it. And we are too, and we're gonna have a fantastic performance. The last couple of seconds, what's the time commitment like? How much time do you two put into this? And it in a week, in a month. You don't want to ask me. <laughs> yeah, been, every Tuesday night, so a weird TV schedule, yeah. it's been able to work. Perfect. Yeah. So concert, May the 10th. May 10th. Right hey, there on We screen. have a graphic, everybody. It's at Pius. And it's free to attend, correct? It is, yep. but you have to reserve your seats. Okay. And you can do that at wiorchestra.org is your website. Yes. We'll talk about how much time you put in okay. when the cameras <laughs> are pointing at you. Thank you so much for both being here yeah, and sharing you. your story with us. Good to know something about your coworkers. Yeah. <laughs>